First of all, right-click on Start, click on the Device Manager. In the Device Manager window, expand disk drives. Right-click on the disk and select Update Drivers. On this window, select Search Automatically for Drivers and it will search and install drivers automatically. Other way around, if you have downloaded drivers from a vendor website, then you can use the second option, Browse My Computer for Drivers, and then select the drivers and install them. For now, I am selecting Search Automatically for Drivers. Once the drivers are installed, you can check if the issue is resolved or not. If the issue is still not resolved, then try another method. Method 2 is run sfc slash scano command. In the search box, type cmd and right-click on it and click on run as administrator. Type sfc slash scano command. This command will check if any corrupt files are there on the system and will try to fix it. This command is going to take some time and you will have to wait until it gets completed. Once this is completed, restart the system once and check if the issue is resolved or not. If the issue does not resolve, try the next method. Method 3 is Update Windows. To update Windows, right-click on the Start and click on Settings. In the Settings page, click on Update and Security. In the Update and Security, install the available updates and restart the system. These are troubleshooting steps you can try to resolve this issue. If the issue does not resolve, you can try with Reset This PC or Install Fresh Operating System. That's it for this video, and if you like this video, please hit the like button, hit subscribe, and press the bell icon to enable notifications for future videos.